Hello guys, today this is a video for Windows 10 and Windows 8.1 users. This is a video that shows you to change your default MIDI device in these operating systems. Now with this software you can use any MIDI device of your choice instead of the Microsoft GS Wavetable and Synth. So the software you gonna look here is Coolsoft MIDI Mapper. Beware though this is a beta stage software and this could cause system instability in case you encounter such instabilities I usually tell you to uninstall this that is this warning that they show up This is an error that frequently occurs in the installation. We are going to ignore. Well, you may say DOSBox and ZDoom or certain other source ports enable changing MIDI device. So why this? Well, for certain source ports like EDUC32 or DXX Rebirth, there is no option to change your MIDI device other than to take the default and I did not have this issue because I was having Windows 7 as my base operating system. Well, this has been tested on Windows 10 and I'm running Windows 8.1 virtual machine. So don't worry, it will work on Windows 10 and Windows 8. Okay, let's start the MIDI mapper. Okay, in this I'm gonna select the virtual MIDI synth port 1 which is running Arachno sound found. Let's test some games for example eduke32. And let's see whether this worked. As you can see, we that worked. So let's change and see whether it works again. Let's try out some more options like the SYXG50. Well, that's it for today guys. Thanks for watching.